Hi, right, welcome back to the Pokemon Isle of Armor Nose Luck. I did a bit of a, bit, bit, a little bit of training. Yeah. So uh we got everyone's basically the same because I didn't really train that much. But uh Boons that level 58, Sludge Bomb Earth Power, Energy Ball, Sleep Powder, honestly. Solid moveset, and that's what I bring to <laughs> online. Basically, and then Guava's Gyro Ball, Hyper Voice, Dazzling Gleam, Flamethrower. Oh, and uh, Ryan, Earthquake, Stone Edge, Megahorn, Hammer On. Those are the three members of the team that I added. Yeah, cool. I also gave everyone items. Now they're all holding items. Cool. Ryan's got the Eevee Light, Black Sludge, and a Pixie Paper Guava. Right, so now we're just gonna go fight Avery. I just want to jump straight into that. Actually, fighting Avery with my Max Blast, with my Max uh, Venusaur is probably a bad idea since he uses Psychic types. Um. But I think I want to anyway. Actually, hold on. Are these- is this already Gigantamax capable? No, it's not, but I have the Max Mushrooms. Let's make Cinderace into its Gigantamax form. I do. Ah, sick. Wait, can I- I can just give it to Bullen even though he's already Gigantamax capable? I don't want to waste my- I don't want to waste my Mushrooms right now. It's three Max Mushrooms, okay. So I guess we'll have to go back into the cave to get more if we need to get him some more max soup. But now we can Gigantamax Cinderace. This is a big field. Well, I mean, it has to be for a Dynamax battle, I guess. Hello, Avery. I'm not gonna lead with Cinderace. Let's lead with uh let's lead with Guava. That's not Guava. Let's lead with Guava. Cause why not? So you've come at last. Defeating you will grant me the secret armor. Then I will have what I need to become a psychic gym leader. I mean I think you already have what you need. You have the balls floating around your head. What more could you need? Honestly, if anyone looked at that, they'd think you're a psychic gym leader. Coming with everything I have. Okay. Were you not doing that before? Mustard and his clone army. I'm cheering for both of you, but one of you a little bit more than the other. Master Dojo's final trial. Ready? You know, it is kind of crazy how they build these giant stadiums and then we just stand this close together because the Dynamax Pokemon stand behind us for some reason. That's oh, that's still something that's really stupid, but whatever. Huh. Wait, what? Okay. Holy top. Wow, where'd you get that? You didn't have that before. Have an elegant battle worthy of being called a finale. Prepare to seek into despair and into the weird battlefield beneath your feet. Psychic terrain. So it starts with psychic terrain. That's actually kind of neat. That he's cheating. <laughs> uh, I'm Pixie Plate. Otherwise, I'd go for Hyper Voice. Hyper Voice is 90, right? Yeah, we should, I should have given it the Silk Scarf, but whatever. That did a lot for a dozen gleam, or, or for a side beam from a ponytail. I mean, the psychic terrain's still up, but I feel like it still did a crazy amount of damage. Kadabra. Alright, we're gonna swap, because I think his side beam will definitely kill Guava. So let's take this chance and go into Ryan. 
Actually, Ryan's special defense is pretty low. I am, I am Eevee Light, but oh my god, it's low. Hmm. I guess we just go into Redhead. No, oh, shut up, loud car. Oh my lord, they did a lot of damage. Hey, can you chill? Uh, yeah, Redhead's not faster. I could Dynamax, but I don't have Dynamax candies, so... Looks like someone's gonna die. Let's see if Ryan can take it. But <laughs> no. Well, I'm sorry, Ryan, but you're gonna have to die. I guess I can just heal it. <laughs> I don't have a no healing rule. I just wasn't healing before this. I'm just gonna keep playing side beam though, so healing it doesn't really save me. Ah, there goes the psychic terrain. I didn't think it would disappear. I thought it was gonna be permanent permanent. Well without it, it should be a bit better. Let's see how much damage it does now. That is a decent amount less, but still not enough for me to just run around. I guess I could swap into Cinderace. I really need a chance to heal Guava. Guava would take this much better. It just does so much damage, and now I'm confused. I guess I'm just gonna sack Ryan. I'm not gonna heal until it runs out of side beams. I'm not about that right now. We're just gonna click Earthquake because they'll die to that anyway. No, Ryan. All right, now we're going to see the race. What? You have three Pokemon left? That's three targets for my G-Max Fireball. How much damage does this do? 160. That's pretty good, actually. It's quite high. Uh, it's like Z-Move level. It doesn't have an additional... It knows abilities, too, I think, as its effect. So if they're Flash Fire, it would get through. I'm not really sure if I like this Gigantamax form. Animation's cool though. I've never seen this one, I've only seen, um... Rillabooms. I mean, I've seen them in the trailer, but I haven't seen them in action. That's what I mean. Two different things. Take by your Swoobat. I get to fire off three Z moves. Slow bro. Okay, this is gonna Dynamax. Um But I might as well just quick fireball. Because I can't do anything else. Oh my god, he got Quick Claw. Because its ability is Quick Claw. It's it's a hilarious ability, I'm actually... <laughs> that's so funny. But, he better not kill me. If he kills me before I get a chance just because he got a Quick Claw... That's not stabs, so it's not gonna kill me. It did do a lot though, and now it's raining. Oh, the rain's really bad actually. Has hey, super effective hit. Don't be hop. That's really bad actually. I wish I had gone for a like, lake airstream or something. 
I did no types of damage. Okay, well he's gonna go for another geyser. So I guess I could go into a bull in here. Alright, let's go into Polly, that's safer. But then I get hit with a psychic move. But I mean Bulin was gonna get psychic move too. I really wish you were swift swim, Polly. Actually, it doesn't matter. I'd be faster than it. I should be faster than it anyway. Slowbro is a, it's very slow. As the name implies. I don't have a switch in for a psychic move, so there's nothing I can do about this. Goodbye, Polly. You're gonna die, but... I mean, you can still Earthquake, right? Ah, are you alright, my elegant Pokemon? My unbelievable psychic power will humiliate you. I feel utterly humiliated. You know, I can't really complain that this battle was too easy. I mean, he didn't really have fully evolved Pokemon, but he was very high level. Granted, I wasn't really attempting to level up my Pokemon at all. But, you know, they were like level 6, this thing's level 66, which is a decent threat for what it is. If I had Sucker Punch, that'd be, oh well, no, I'd still get hit with Max Geyser. So, let's just go into Redhead, I think, and click a quick on when he turns small. Yeah. I think it dies to this. Oh my god. How could I forget about Quick Claw? I die now because he's faster because of Quick Claw. No, Redhead. I liked you because of your name. This is lame. I'm mad. Well, we have Earth Power. Please don't get Quick Claw. <laughs> 67. Actually, let's sleep powder. That's way better. Thank you for not missing. Jeez. <laughs> I can't believe he got the quick draw on, on two important quick draws. Because I would have done so much more damage if he didn't quick draw that Max Geyser. I would have had a chance to, you know, do some good damage with my Max Fireball. But when he set up the rain, that ruined everything. Oh uh, yeah, see, it would've lived. And he wakes up. Wait, confusion is the psychic move it has? Oh my god! <laughs> Calm down, please. Uh, I really don't want to get quick draw, but I don't have any switch-ins anymore, so, uh... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I didn't expect to get obliterated by this. Maybe next time I'll train up my team a little bit more. But there were no trainers, so... Like, like there were no trainers on the, on the aisle at all for me to gauge my strength against, so I had no idea that I needed to level up at all. It is really lame that there's, like, no trainers on the island. There's, it's just completely blank. It's all wild Pokemon, which is cool, but... Like, where are the people to fight against? Because there's not really anything to do except for just do this straight story. Oh well. Oh well done, you both give it your all. That's what makes it feel so fast, because I'm, I'm progressing through this really quickly. The reason for that is because there's no trainers. <laughs> the only battles we're having are against the Avery. How pathetic, even though I lost, even though I resorted to such underhanded tactics. There's an average man who gave everything he possibly could. Perhaps it's time I stopped playing around and gave up my dream of becoming a gym leader. After the less than reputable things I did, I'm likely to be expelled from the dojo. You're free to tell the master. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry for what I did. Oh, no need to tell me. You can't hide anything from little old me. Yeah, the ground was clearly uh, glowing with psychic energy. I should apologize on Avery's behalf. What he did was wrong, but he didn't want to be beaten by his rival. He's a good, hard-working student. <laughs> Master, thank you. As your punishment, you're gonna look after the Pokemon in the dojo for six months by yourself.
Okay. Alright, things are settled here. I'm so proud of you both. You mustered so much effort and tried so hard. Uh, uh, get it. You mustered so much effort. I got so teared up I couldn't even see half the battle, but what I saw was amazing. <laughs> Out the trials, I grant the secret armor. It'll take some time to repair, so go ahead and get things sorted. Oh, great. I guess all we have to do is go talk to him. What do you want? Ah, uh, it's the lead card. Okay. Here's my trading card. Goodbye, Avery. Here's my card. Alright, great. So, uh, we, we lost half our team. That is true. But if you look at it, uh, as if the team wasn't really there to begin with, then it, it doesn't look as devastating. I know, pretty sound advice. See, just pretend that Redhead, Ryan, and, uh, sorry, Ryan. I mean, Redhead. Just pretend Redhead, Ryan, and Polly didn't exist, and, uh, you know, we can't, we won't have to remember them. I will need these items back though, because these are the only ones I have, and I need these for competitive. Thank you. Goodbye. Alright, great, what do we have left? We have Tentacruel, who's joining. I guess we have Blitbug, I don't have a bug or a psychic type. He's joining. And then we have, uh, I guess I could go with this, but I'm gonna go with the, uh, the Happini, and hope that we can get an Oval Stone. Or maybe I'll look it up and see where we can find one. I'll also probably level everyone up to like 65, because uh, that battle was very high leveled, and I assume that ones in the future will be similar. Alright, so I'm gonna end this episode here. We'll, we'll do whatever Mustard's talk, talking about and get the secret armor very soon. Yeah, thanks for watching. We'll be back next time. Bye.